So the question here is how many three-letter words can be formed from the letters A, B, C all the way down to X, Y, Z if the letters are sampled first of all without replacement and then after that with replacement. So let's start with part A. And for part A uh, we want to form words that might be dictionary words like for example the, uh, the word pig or you could have words like BSA which don't occur in the dictionary, Boy Scouts of America, you might have COR for computational operations research etc. So I'm gonna solve this question in two different ways and the first way that I'm going to solve it is I'm gonna solve it using the multiplication rule. So I'm gonna draw three blanks here and those three blanks represent the three letters that are being chosen. There are 26 ways to choose that first letter. But then, since you're sampling without replacement, there are only 25 ways to choose the middle letter, and finally 24 ways to choose the last letter. And when you multiply that out, that is 15,600 different ways to choose all the letters. Now, the uh, second way to solve this problem is by using permutations. And in this case we have n equals 26 objects and we are choosing three of those objects. So using the formula from the previous page we have 26 factorial divided by 26 minus 3 factorial different ways of choosing the letters. This can also be written as 26 factorial divided by 23 factorial and if you'll notice that as things cancel here um, 23 and down will cancel for the numerator and the denominator and since that's the case this turns out to be just 26 times 25 times 24 which is 15,000 600 just as in the multiplication rule. So that's the first solution to the to uh, or that's the solution to part A and now we're going to move on to part B. So for part B this time we're sampling with replacement so this time we're allowing not only words like pig and BSA but we're also allowing repeats so you could have AAA for American Automobile Association, AMA, American Medical Association, WWW for the World Wide Web, etc. So those are the types of uh, words that you can form when you're sampling with replacement. So once again we're going to start with the multiplication rule and there are 26 choices for the first letter but since we're sampling with replacement there's 26 choices for the second letter and 26 choices for the third letter and when you multiply that out you get 17,576. This cannot be solved using permutations because you aren't sampling uh, without replacement and notice that the difference between these two you get more words as you expect and you can see a couple of those would be uh, these these last three here are examples of those extra words you can form because you're sampling with replacement. So it is intuitive that this number over here should be a little bit higher than the other.